Christmas surprise gone wrong in Saugus, and now the family can laugh about it. But there weren't too many smiles when the homeowners called the cops on their own son. Tonight, KK Line's Greg Mills is live in Saugus with this holiday mishap. Greg? Boy, I'll tell you what, Susie, when a Christmas surprise ends up with someone in handcuffs, you know it didn't go exactly as planned. While enjoying Christmas 20 miles from home, this ring video got Dana Olga's attention, and she quickly got her husband's attention. Somebody just walked into our house. I, we got to go. <laughs> That's when I dialed 911. Sheriff's deputies got to the Olga's Saugus home before they did. Guns drawn. They told Frank over the phone they got the intruder. Very relieved that they stated to us that they caught the person, but we didn't know it was our own son. Yep, that's their son in handcuffs on Christmas Day. A surprise visit from his Nevada home to his parents' home that didn't quite finish the way he planned. He got surprised too. He certainly did. Pictures inside the house and his old California license quickly settled the matter with the deputy. And they gave him the phone. He said, uh, hey, Dad, it's me. By the time the couple got home, the deputies were gone, and their son was laughing with the neighbors. The Olegas can laugh now, too, but not at first. We just wanted to kill him. You know, we wanted to strangle the kid, you know. As you can imagine, the surprise end to a surprise visit is a pretty big hit on social media. Some comments are pretty funny, like this one. Next year's Christmas letter should be a hoot. Perhaps they could use this photo as a family card. By the way, the Olga's son did not want to talk about what happened yesterday. In Saugus, Greg Mills, KCAL 9 News. Susie and Jeff, back to you. Today. All right, Greg, thank you very much.